Alrighty guys, what is going on? So we're starting this vlog off a little different here. So we're starting things off at 1.23 a.m. Just to give a little bit of context because we're just finishing up a report here. Just typing about um, ion exchange resin PO4. So if I'm absolutely dead tomorrow, this is why. So six relatively short hours later, the alarm goes off and we're back at it. First class of the day done. I had nowhere to site building to do an online geography lecture. And after that, we'll have one more lecture. And It'll be time for a group meeting. 9.52, eight minutes before the next lecture. Let's see how much of this slide we can get done. And there we go. One minute before my lecture. That slide, that slide, done. You know, you just gotta use every available second. Alrighty guys, it's 2.30 in the afternoon. My main meeting went well. Solid meeting with the group. Talked about what needed to be done. Nice and efficient, only lasts 10 minutes or so. And then I just hung out in the site building and just worked on my slides for the presentation, grinded out six of those, finished them all. So that's done. About to hop the train, go home. Alrighty guys, so just picked up some Thai food here because we've been grinding recently. We've been just going at it. So it's nice after all the hard work to have a little re reward. I was walking home from the train station, passed by this little Thai place. Smelt that sweet, sweet smell of Thai food coming out of the restaurant. So had to pick up some, some Pad Thai. Mmm. Unreal. So I'm gonna eat this, just take it easy, watch some YouTube here. I've finished everything that has to be done for t t today, but I have a design project due in a week and a half. So I should definitely work on that. So yeah, I'll take a couple hours, take a load off and then get back to work. Yo, I got two fortunes? I get to pick my fortune? You get what you want through your charm and personality. Um, I'd like to say, you get what you want through your grit and determination is what that should say. You find beauty in ordinary things. Do not lose this ability. That's honestly tr true. I do honestly just enjoy living life. Alrighty guys, so it is 10 o'clock here. I'm um, just working away at the slides, just doing a couple finishing touches with the group. Uh, we're gonna call in a couple minutes, just go over, go over everything because we have our presentation for this class tomorrow. Um, these are the slides I got done today when I was working on site. Um, so. I was looking decent and then once this is done, once we have our presentation tomorrow, we'll just hand in this report. There's a couple of finishing touches left, but as of right now, it's looking pretty decent. 
And that'll be one step closer to finishing all these final assignments. There is a week and a half left of classes and then exams. So the semester's actually wrapping up. There really isn't much time left. So it's just like, go, go, go to get these last final things done. Then it'll be grind for exams. And then peace out third year, we're done. <laughs>it is 11 o'clock now so pretty much done the entire presentation here just one last thing to do and that's to find the price of the ion exchange resin po4 adsorbent scour the internet N nothing around N no information anywhere nobody knows anything so this is where we make something called an estimate Basically, you just try and calculate something. Is it gonna be right? Probably not, but it's gonna be close. And as long as you use some sound engineering logic, the professor will be happy. So it says that um, on exchange resin ranges from eight cents to 21 cents per thousand liters. So let's just go with the highest amount. So 21, dollars phosphate, PO4, is 76 us dollars per metric ton 76 we'll convert that into cad to divide by 0 0.8 just doing a unit conversion here what we're going to do is take the highest density because this will um, give us the most mass per unit volume usually the price of the reactants in a reaction account for 70% of the total cost, which means the other 30% will be like the operating cost of the system. So let me add 30% to this. So multiply by 1.13. And then that's going to give me a final value of $0.0015 per mil. Now, if, if this was going to like actually be used in the field, we'd probably add like another like 50% safety factor on this because this number is probably bejangled, but um, we're not in the field and we're just calculating this for an assignment. So it's probably good. All right, it's 12 o'clock now. On the dot. Presentation's done. Homework for tonight's done. I was thinking of doing of working on my simulation for my design project, but I think I'm just gonna call it a night. Yeah, just remembered how this video first started. I was here in this seat this morning at what time? Like 2 30 a.m. or something like that. So, considering I only got five and a half hours of sleep um, before today, honestly, didn't feel too, too bad. You just kind of get used to running off not that much sleep. But too many nights of not enough sleep in a row, and that will catch up with you. And then you will get f So tonight we're getting the solid seven hours, the, the doctor recommendation. So it's going to be nice. All right, guys. <sighs> Good night.